Welcome back, I am SV and as you remember in last my tutorial we are create some life which is spawned on my location and which is give me some uh, some lives, yes as you remember. So like I told you today we will work with uh, stamina, with fly energy or something like that and today we will add some particle effect. So I think I think we will start with some First of all, with some stamina. So we are create one more. We are create one more uh, blueprint class, and it will be just standard actor. So it will be just a fly, something like that. Uh, open that, and again inside in the fly we add some flip flop. But before we have to create this flip flop, uh, you see I have many many different different options. So later uh, we will take out this. But now I am going to. Uh, texture, I'm going, not, not texture, sprite, sorry. I take first my sprite, right click, create flip flop. We are calling it, uh, we are, can call it fly, something like that, open. So we are make it little bit smaller. Let's say put down, something like that. Take my all other, not one, from this to this area and put somewhere here open and what we have okay we have everything good again i will make it 24 just to make it little bit faster and as you can see how it's rolling yes if you like you can make a more better animation inside in uh inside how is calling uh in cinema 4d and it will be more beautiful and as you can see here i have some default material so i have to open that and put some you know you remember yes sprite first of all we are going to sprite and now we are find uh, translucent units sprite material something like that so very nice no collision 24 some array save and close what we are doing now so we are going to blueprints, we are going to our fly actor, and inside in the self we are create a flip book, you remember, yeah? Flip book. So we are calling it fly. Something ah uh, come on, what's the problem? Again. Flip book. Rename fly. Yeah. Now it's okay. So going to source book and add, you see, we already have it. So what is this tutorial? I don't know, doesn't matter. Very nice. Also, I reduce the size 0 0.1, 0 0.1, 0 0.1. Now we will add to my fly some sphere component for collision sphere. Uh, you remember we are create for our um, heart 0 0.5, something like that. Very nice. So uh flip book haven't any collision no any collision what else we are going to flip book and we are make some third priority maybe it will be one zero two i don't know we will make like this doesn't matter and 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 we have to check yeah translucity unit is already done and override material no, no any overwriting material for, for a moment. Going to event graph, select sphere. This we no need. Uh, right click, select sphere, right click, add on collision, on begin overlap. So first of all, we make a cast to my pawn. My pawn. Yes, something like that. Very nice. So now we are take some... Um, what we are take we are take our fly energy you remember yes we are calling it fly energy yes set fly energy but we can we have to get this fly energy um yes we are get fly energy here i make a branch if so what we will do now now we are check our fly energy if our fly energy will be more than 100 more or equal 100 something like that we are going here and we are set i put a fly energy again set fly energy uh, 
to 100. It means if I pick up this object and if my fly energy will be full, I will set up again to full. My fly energy cannot be 125 or more or something like that. A maximum my fly energy can be 100. But uh, yeah, here, yes, I forget to put 100. But if my fly energy will be less than 100, I go in here, so I make a copy paste. I set my fly energy, take my fly energy and make it plus, where is my plus? Uh, 20, yes, I think 20. I pick up 20. So I have to pick up five of these flowers to receive uh, to receive a good result, something like that. So, and here, I forget to put here. I take this, put somewhere he like here. Yeah. And from here, I connect like this. Looks like very nice. Looks like very nice. And this a little bit, or I can put it up. It will be more interesting, yeah? Design, yeah. Something like that. So, again, I check my fly energy. If my fly energy already 100 or more, I set my fly energy to 100. But if my fly energy less than 100, I am going here and make plus 20. That's all. So, what we will do now, uh, set priority we no need after that we have to destroy and if i pick up my fly energy if i pick up i will destroy this actor something like that here i no need yeah so save uh, and go to spawn okay now we are create a new custom object uh, custom event sorry a name will be spawn fly something like that okay first of all i start here also one more pin and make it spawn fly where is this spawn fly you see how many how many events we have here yeah spawn fly very nice so what we are doing with spawn fly first of all we are going to spawn some actor uh just a moment give me to sync we are make some delay delay this delay will be random random in range from 10 to 20 seconds something like that after this delay we are going to spawn actor spawn actor from class we are take class fly you remember our class which we are created. Now where is to spawn? Split pin and split one more time. So first of all location will be 800 somewhere behind all the scene. And my Z location I just take like here. So I just copy and paste. My Z location will be from 80 to 200. Same like, uh, same like my uh, lives. What next? Next, I just copy this one and put somewhere here, something like this. Good. So I add for my fly movement projection and then add velocity in local space. Same like uh, speed land. What I'm doing next, when it's finished, I going and again spawn fly. Spawn fly. One more time. Uh, so, looks like everything done, we are safe, and we are going for check inside in the game, how it's working. Okay, we are start jump, so coming some spawning, and we will see. Jump, very nice, again, I still cannot see any, any flowers, where is my flowers? Yeah, it's here, so look at this. I pick up and it's coming plus 20. If I don't pick up, coming nothing. It means it's working mm, from 10 to 20 seconds. Yeah, again, you see and different uh, high take and almost full. So looks like already some gameplay we have. Uh, what we will do now? Now I show you how to make, yeah, first of all, we are make something like that. It will be a 
live spawn very nice and it will be fly spawn good very nice so what we will do now now i like to make some particle effect so when i uh, pick up some life or when i pick up some fly i will get some particles so it's like a visual visual elements which is really create not necessary but if you are doing it will be more beautiful so i open i no need this this and this as you remember in last my tutorials we are switch only to find some materials okay now we have to create new folder add new folder name of this folder will be material for what we need it because i like to receive my particles with some uh, material so how to do it open that and create new material name of this material will be life i can make like this mat life mat life material open and go ahead so this is like a material editor first of all if you like to apply this material to particle effect you have to change you have to change uh, blend mode to translucent something like that okay you see every time when you are change something you have a different modes so you have to put translucent something like that after that right click and add not texture something like this texture sample add this node so inside texture sample you have texture take and try to find our our heart this one yeah very nice so uh, as you can see we have many different escapes many different escapes so as i remember this is uh, like a diffuse or basic color and this is alpha so alpha i put inside in opacity and diffuse color i put inside in emission color we have to wait a little bit you see now coming some compiling shaders we have to wait because we are at new shader inside with some alpha channel with something else and this already our material so very soon we have to wait a little bit and very soon i will show you how it's working okay as you can see we have here some material so what we will do now we are close it and we are create new folder inside in content browser name of this folder will be particle so maybe i change some color of this particle maybe it will be like something something like that doesn't matter okay right click inside in this folder and create a particle system so it will be live particle open and we have some particles so as you can see coming some small crosses small crosses now i'm select this required and here you see material default particle so i open that and i have already created my life material just push it and look what i have so coming some little bit time again coming some shadering and 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 very soon we will get some some uh, some particles almost finish 12 6 yeah very good so and where is my particle why i cannot see it maybe i have to save it should be somewhere hmm just a moment we will try to save material just save it maybe because i didn't save i i i cannot receive something can fly so now coming saving and maybe so you see all time some materials taking some long time but it's normally because later it working very fast wait a little bit come on i hope it's not stuck it 
okay it's saved going to live materials okay and i can see it i can see it and it looks like very nice you can see we can increase and this is my particles so what i like to receive i like to receive some splashes some splashes of this um how is calling of these um, hearts so i am going to spawn open spawn and raid rate rate scale rate distribution so constant 20 you see if i increase here i have more if i make like this for example i have less only one will be yeah but i put here zero i no need any rate of spawn no need so i am going to i am going to burst or burst burst i think burst then i take it and create i think one more element okay open this element and count make it for example 100 and what i have one time i have many many hearts which is spawning you see very nice uh what next i'm doing just give me to sync scale yes i'm keep like this okay very nice so for a moment i'm finished with here now i'm going to lifetime open lifetime and inside lifetime open this distribution minimum one maximum three or oh, maximum one i have to change this maximum for three so it's mean one my life going out and other coming back looks like something something happen yeah O only i forget to change something i'm going to requirement and going down and here i have some emitter loop so if i have zero it mean it will it coming looping non-stop non-stop but i like to make only one loop so i call this emitter only one time until it will be finished so it's going to finish and again emitter going to finish and again emitter so what i have next next i have uh, initial size open initial size start distribution again open so minimum and maximum i like to receive some randomized so my minimums uh, will be 10 and my maximum will be 25 as you can see some my hearts will be very small in beginning and some my hearts will be very big in beginning uh, what next next we are going to velocity open velocity and i have some start velocity open this again distribution and what we have this i keep like this here i maybe put zero and i like to receive this splash to right side later i will show you inside in the game why it's like this or maybe maybe not maybe for a moment i keep i keep like this uh, just to show you later so and last one i have i like to change some how is calling some size of these hearts so right click here and as you can see i have many many different options to change my uh, hearts to give some effect for these hearts so i am going for size and i take this size uh, size by life size by life something like that so what we will doing what we will doing we are going to size life multiply distribution yes maybe like this vector constant curve open this and we have two arrays one and uh, zero and one okay and here we have some value so one zero one some value value it is it's mean uh, it's how to explain it's like a time so for example zero is beginning of life one is already end of the life it's like a hundred percent from zero to hundred percent so if i put for example when my uh, when my hearts will be in 100 percent of life size will be zero and look at this and my my heart's going to very 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 small size so also i can add some additional element maybe i will make like so i will go back to one and i create one more point i like to make like a curve 
like a line. So here will be 0 and will be size 1. After that I am going to 1 and it will be 90% of life, 0 0.9. And size I like to make more, 2, 2 and one more time 2. And after that here will be 100% of life and my stars will be going to zero. You see, something like that. It's going more and then going to out. Looks like very nice. Save. Uh, we are finished for a moment with these uh, lives. We are going to life. Our, you remember, this is our actor. And somewhere here we are create, just a moment. Somewhere here we are create spawn, 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 emitter at location. Not attached, at location. Question is, which emitter wheels we are spawn? Open, and we have only one, live part, for example, live particles. So now I no need this, I add this, something like this. Okay, very good. Question is, in which location we have to create it? So if I start a play, now I show you a problem, yeah? Just a moment, I start to play. I have to lose one life now. Something like that, very soon coming new life. We will see, we have to wait. Where is my life? Okay, my life coming. So I take it and from zero location coming these hearts. Uh, I have to change this location. And for this reason, I take my default scene, my actor. After that, I take location somewhere downstairs I'm going and get relative location. After that, I apply it here. Something like this. So play. And check one more time. So this is, will be location of my scene. Now I lose one life. <laughs> okay, very soon coming life. Maybe I will reduce little bit time for spawning for this, just for show you some some kind of this tutorial, some settings. Yes, okay, coming it. Look at this. Now I take, and it's coming from this location. But as you can see, it's coming directly up and not moving uh, with the game. So for this reason, we are going to live part. We are going to velocity, and this velocity we make a minus two hundred. You see, I have like this. Pam. And maybe here will be zero. Some coming on top, some coming on forward. Very nice. So now we are going to spawn. I reduce a time from one to five seconds, for example, for a moment. And play again. And look at this what we have. Now we have some like like kind of the speed. And it will be more beautiful. We have to wait a little bit. Okay, it's coming. Look at this. I take it. And it's coming like a back. And looks like very nice. Okay, uh, so for a moment this is my tutorial completed. Thank you very much for watching. I'm changed back for 10 seconds and 30 seconds. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And see you next time. Goodbye, friends.